Well, greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back once again to the Farts and Crap Show, where I'm pretty sure today is part 116. And I'm not positive. However, I'm pretty sure I know what's up with this... Whoa. Sorry. With this, uh, puzzle. Um... I don't know how to get the chest over there, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. I noticed this is kind of similar to the layout of a pinball machine, so I think we're supposed to put a cryonis block there. So yeah, instead of falling through that hole, it goes to the next one, and then another cryonis block right there, so it goes down this ramp, and then I need a wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, but not all the way up, a little bit, so it does roll down at a less steep angle. And then a block right below this line. So it falls down here, and that's not right. It's got to be right, though. Well, let's find out. Um, we got to place some cryonis blocks, though. Is that? Oh, there's a switch down there. And there's a return basket right there. Is that what that is? It's kind of like pinball, though. Kind of like pachinko, kind of like pinball. I could see either one. Okay, so we don't want it going right there. We need it to fall. Oh, that would do that. Oh, but it does be like that, though. Is that good? Okay, yes. Okay. Then... There. Oh, okay. Wait, what if we just have it roll further? Because how am I going to get that the other way? I can't. So I was wrong about that. Sorry. Ah, oh, frick, that doesn't have enough momentum. Uh, come on. Why? Frick. Thank you. Okay, that should be good, and then it drops. No, I was right the first time. Yeah, I just needed to not flop down that far. Why is it not letting me do the thing? There it goes. I'm gonna see if that's okay. Can't be right. Unless I drop it down the other way, but that's not enough. Oh, maybe it is. Oh, there's no bottom to that basket, is there? Oh, there is no bottom to that basket. It's just helping the thing get there. Okay, I see what's going on. Okay, so I was right. 
It's not as complicated as I thought. Did I push it off on accident? Understand this one. That might be good enough. Oh, I can stasis the ball, right? Right. Okay. Could I actually do that? Hold on, if I could, it might work. If I can find a way across that. Okay, yeah, there we go. If I get it to roll like evenly enough, that might be okay. Then it only drops shit. <sighs> Even if I get it past that, like, it's not. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is this a trick? Do I. Do I even need the first one? What if I jump over there and make it go the other way? That'd be like way easier. I mean, I need something to hold on to, so like, at the very least, I need it to be like. That? I can, I can make that, I think. If I can't. That. I could make that, right? Yeah. don't think this is how you're supposed to do it. <laughs> but you know what? Forget how you're supposed to do it. It doesn't matter. Okay. can do that. There we go. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't want to hitting that, so... I'll do that. And then... Wait a second, if I'm going... Let's get rid of that. If I'm going to do this though, I need... Oh wait. Right? I, mean, I could just stasis it from here and then shoot the thing, right? Is Link really not heavy enough? Are you kidding me? Alright, that that does it. I can I can just do this without him.
can't have it fall down that hole. Okay, I see what's up. Okay, so I need... I need a block here, but won't that get rid of my other one? It'll get rid of my first one, I think. If I go like... Oh shit, that's an ancient arrow. Whoops, those are valuable. You gotta be shitting me. Definitely not how you're supposed to do this, but you know what? I don't give a fuck right now. That did do like a pinball. It is a pinball kind of thing. Oh, and that's how you get the. Th okay, I see. So you are supposed to do it that way. What am I hitting? Oh, there's a ceiling piece. Okay, I see. Okay, and then that knocked it in the- okay, I see, that's cool. I don't think that's- I'm pretty sure that's not how you're supposed to do that, but you know what, it worked, so I don't care. Dude, that's actually worth it. That is actually worth it. Yeah, why else would they have a bridge over here? There is a bridge over here, I could have walked. Well, I feel like a dummy. Man, I am really glad I decided to do this in a new episode instead of the first one. That was pretty cool. It's like, okay, I got the ball to stop. <laughs> I just pop, 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 pop. You must go to Divine Beast Varuta. Varuta. Sorry. <laughs> Mabby. Mabby. <laughs> Fuck. I'm hungry. Shut up, stomach. I know. I know. Oh, they... This motherfucker. Who does he think he is? Whose high roll do you think this is, motherfucker? Yo. What do you think you're doing? Being a moblin and shit? <laughs> I'll take that. Get rid of that. Uh, yeah, I can kind of see that, but that's not where it showed on the picture. They were. But that is not where it showed on the picture. Oh, unless they were pointing this thing out. Oh, maybe. That would make more sense, wouldn't it? Yeah, that does make more sense. That matches up better. 
I thought this little fork thing was actually this little fork thing. So that's why I was like over here. But that actually is kind of parallel with like the base of it right here. It's just, it looks different on a topographical map rather than like a satellite view kind of thing. Do I'll take some acorns, some fucking mushrooms. Thing over here, it doesn't matter. Got to get my rock breaker. Cool. Well, this should be interesting. I'll probably fight in the Zora armor. More than likely, probably silver scale spear and one of those two-handed swords. Probably... Uh, let me guess, food would probably be Hillian Bass. Um, what else is native around here? Mushrooms, I guess. Um, I was trying to predict what I would have. Do they have shields? What kind of shields? I guess they wouldn't have a shield. Probably a bow of some sort. Because I think you actually need a bow for the divine... Blah, 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 blah. The, uh, the Blight, whatever the Ganon Blight is for this one. To the one who approaches this divine beast in the name of Goddess Helia, I offer this trial. In exchange for Rudus Rub, this is the same shit all the other divine beasts have told you, isn't it? Those who lack determination will find the trial unforgiving. Do not take this place lightly, or this message is merely a world within your mind. To keep it, you know. I think the Zora armor is still my favorite. It's really fucking cool. Really fucking cool. Um, what kind of Zora, what kind of Zora, what kind of bow would the Zora use? A forest Dweller? No, that's not right. Do they actually have bows? Oh, that is a Zora bow. That thing is dope. This illusory realm was created from the depths of your memories. The enemy you shall face is a product of the fear that dwells within. You must overcome shit. This battle is a trial of the soul. You must emerge victorious using only the tools you are provided. Yeah, I'll fuck him up. Hmm. Watch out for a spear. He also has a pole arm. <laughs> Dude, light scale trident, ceremonial trident, two of these. Spear strength and durability are inferior. I don't care. I'll use the light scale first, I guess. Silver bow. Silver bow. Silver bow. Ten arrows. Jeez. Oh, I was right. I was right on those. Fleet Lotus Seeds, huh? Huh. So I was right on the armor. I was right two out of three on the food. And yeah. It's pretty close. Okay, what's up? Oh. Wait, did that do it? That didn't damage him. Oh, really? Bye.
up. Oh, that was cool. What up? Yeah. I mean, if he wasn't gonna make me work for it, why even go through the... You know? Okay, now he makes it harder, right? Yeah. Gotcha. Uh, excuse me? I hit the... I hit the, like, shooty shoe button. Damn it. Damn it. Fuck. No, you fucking idiot. Okay, I'm hitting... Uh, hello. Okay, what? The what? Oh no. What a douche. Don't you have to, like... Wait a minute, am I supposed to stasis it? Hit it back to him? Not where I'm hitting it, but whatever. Oh, that is what I'm supposed to do. Okay, I gotcha. I've never even considered doing that before. Whoops. Fuck. Okay. Would break most of them except for the last one. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, really? Do you just need to use more force, or what's going on with this one? Oh, yeah, I think that's what's up. Okay. Come on, get over there. Dude, I never even considered doing that before. Oh. Cool. Cool story, bro. Can I flurry rush him? He's too far away, right? Yeah, it's too far away. Three arrows left. Gotta make him count. 
Alright, it's fine. We can do the song and dance. I don't give a fuck. Are you fucking kidding me? Let me get to you. Let me get to you. Hold on. Hold on. Thank you. Dude, I didn't even know he could do that. had plenty of arrows so that's what I usually do I just chuck arrows at them do you have a decent bow dude it's easy easy peasy la 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 lemon squeezy are you still adrift in thought you seem lost to the whims of your mind oh Pardon me. I suppose it's none of my business. Ah, wandering around here and listening to anecdotes about Champion Mifa has truly invigorated me. In fact, it has inspired me to honor her in my own way, separate from my teacher's unfinished song. That is why I felt inclined to roost here near the divine beast of our root, which Mifa herself mastered. Mm. I've written a song to try and capture the essence of Champion Mifa. Recall the champion of Ruta's wrath Before she walked to chosen path Mifa's kindness was known to all Which is why the princess came to call I got better <laughs> Running gag and a Monty Python so joke. Princess, may I ask who the other chosen champions are? Goron Vigilance, Daruk. Rito Confidence, Rivali. Gerudo Spirit, Urbosa. And also, the Hylian with the sword that seals the darkness. <gasps> Link. Oh. Still too young to swim up this big waterfall. One day, Princess, I must leave him to face my fate with Ruta. Sweet Sidon, should fate ever part us, I'm counting on you to protect our beloved home from harm. Understood? I believe in you. Now, shall we try one more time? <laughs> Ha <laughs> 
Oh my goodness. That's the fucking cutest. I mean, people would argue that Sidon grows up to be even cuter. But Mifa is just fucking adorable, man. For a second I thought, oh geez, Mifa already had a child with Link. <laughs> but no, Sidon. Oh, what if Sidon is Link's child? What if, what if Mifa is Sidon's mother and not his sister? <sighs> dun dun dun. But that's just a hypothesis. A game hypothesis. All right, whatever. Hmm. Though she was known for her kindness, it seems the Zora princess could be quite strict when necessary. So, what do you think of Champion Mifa's song? By writing a song that captures the determination of Champion Mifa, I feel closer than ever to my dear teacher. The missing verses in an ancient song. I think the perfect setting would be Hyrule Castle in the distant past. You're so strong. So much stronger than before. The power of Mipha's grace will now recharge much faster. As powerful as you are, I am certain you can save Hyrule as well as the princess who awaits you. Cool. I feel bad for Mifa, though. I, Mazkoshia, I must commend you for conquering the trial thus far. The door to the final trial is now open at the tr Shrine of Resurrection. Go and face your destiny. He's like, where was that place again? <laughs> cool. Oh shit, yeah, dude, we got like 20 minutes. I could go do that now. I honestly have no idea how long it's going to take, but... 20 minutes might be enough. Possibly. Potentially. Probably not. Or I could go find Kilton, considering it is nighttime. And all I would have to do is go to one of the towns where he can show up. But nah. Alright. Oh yeah. To the brave soul who wishes to master a divine beast, you have done well to return something. You have overcome many challenges thus far. Now, allow me to bestow upon you one final trial. Return the Sheikah Slate to the terminal you first obtained it from. Do so, and the final passageway will reveal itself. Sick. Um... Did the game just turn me around? Oh, no, 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 no. It turned the camera around. Okay. That's different. Well, considering this is the final thing of the champion's ballad. Yeah, we could do it now. We got like 20 minutes. I think we have time. And I'm going to womp, 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 do that. It has fulfilled its duty. It slumbers peacefully. That's it? Well, I guess now it's more of a proper shrine since it has the, uh... Uh... I forget what those are called. Like, 
the wording things, whatever, something, whatever. Oh shit, fuck. I didn't mean to skip it. Damn it. Sorry, force of habit. My bad. Mm, my bad. Mm, I hope I didn't skip anything important. Frick. I don't think so. Wait, what? Wait, what? That was not that way a second ago. The Korok is gone. What is happening? Wait a minute, are we going down or is something coming up? Oh, jeez. Yeah, something is going up. Welcome, hero. You have overcome many trials to reach me. Now it is time to face the final trial. This trial is a complex labyrinth. To start, you will need a map. You may obtain map information from the Guidance Stone. Dude, I freaking called it. I freaking called it that this was going to be a divine beast. So Link does have his own divine beast. Wait, can I not use Revali's Gale in here? Just like in a divine. Dude. Makes so much more sense now. The champion's ballad. I get it. Oh, man. We definitely don't have time for this. This is definitely going to take more than 20 minutes. Alright, guys. Um, yeah, I mean, 40 minutes. Is, yeah, that's, that's pretty close to normal. So. Anyhow. Uh, thank you all for being here. I've been your host for this video, Danja McCraps. Uh, I hope you guys are excited for the final trial. The Divine Beast of the Hero of Hyrule. Ah, so cool. This is exactly what I wanted. Because I was like, all the other champions have Divine Beasts. That's what I, it's what I was talking about at the beginning of the DLC. Uh, uh, so cool, so cool. I mean, I know a little bit about what's going to happen, but I did not know about this. This is cool. Mm. Okay, and this explains why... Excuse me, this explains why... The Great Plateau is the way it is. Like this big chunk of land that was just like here like and not somewhere else and all this other. It, it there's a little bit where it's I could nitpick but you know it makes sense it's satisfying the game was alluding to this and it's here I'm excited about this. So thank you all for being here. I've been your host, Daniel McCraft. I already said that part. I uh, hope you guys have a beautiful day. Many blessings on your journey. And until next time, we love you guys. Peace out.